Hello family, this is Beverly Black. And how is everyone doing today? I hope you all are doing well. But today we're going to make some walnut brittle. You can either make use walnut, pecans, or peanuts. So today I'm using peanuts and making it in the microwave. So stay tuned so you can learn how to make walnut brittle and our peanut brittle in the microwave. And welcome family, welcome back into our kitchen. And for those who are here for the first time, welcome. And I ask that if you want to, come on and join this family. Hit that subscribe button down at the end. Everyone, please share, share out this video. Show the love and share it out. So come on and stay around for a few minutes and watch and see how I make this microwave walnut brittle. This walnut brittle is very easy to make. And what you will need is one cup of white sugar, a half a cup of white uh, Caro syrup or whatever brand you have of white syrup. Okay, a cup and a half. I have a cup and a half here of walnuts. You can use cashews, uh, peanuts, the raw or the baked ones, or pecans. You can use either one, either nut, whichever one that you prefer. You need a dash of salt, one tablespoon of butter or margarine, one teaspoon of vanilla, and a teaspoon and a half of baking soda. So let's get started. The first thing I need to do is sp spray the baking uh, pan that we'll be putting the, the brittle on. So get it ready. I'll put parchment paper in it, however you want to do it. First, we're going to combine the one cup of sugar, and the half a cup of white syrup. And we're gonna cook this in the microwave for nine to 10 minutes or until it start browning. You need to stir it at least twice while it is in the microwave. Remember to use a microwave dish and a glass dish is better. And uh, don't, don't forget what I was getting ready to say. But let's just stir this up together. And then we're going to combine the nuts and stir them up. And I'm going to put this in the microwave on high for nine to 10 minutes or until it start browning. I'll be right back when this process is done. It is in the microwave cooking and has two, less than two minutes to go. Make sure you use a glass container because a Tupperware container, it may be too hot for it. Stirring it twice as I've told you several times before. And then when we take it out, we'll add the last ingredients and uh, let it chill. It is brown and out of the microwave. In, in my microwave, it took about seven minutes. So now we're going to add the, uh, the butter or margarine, whichever one you prefer. The one teaspoon of vanilla. Ooh, it's sizzling. Okay. 
Make sure you use, um, have something to grab. Peanut brittle or walnut brittle has cooled off, so I am getting ready to break it up and put it here. Woo! Breaks up good. Look. Very easy to make. Very easy to make. Microwave. Peanut, walnut, griddle. Thank you everyone for coming today. And please remember to share out this video. And subscribe if you haven't subscribed to this channel. I would appreciate it. And this griddle is looking fantastic. I want to tell you one more thing. Remember that I love you. And I thank God for each and every one of you. And keep on trusting and believing in the Lord. Everyone have a blessed and prosperous day. Bye-bye. Heart's desire I'm growing into a fire